Arte. Ó, oh, ele... Ó, ó, ó. Pickers Advantage. Pickers Advantage. Arte! Fala do cachorro do Arte! Fala galera, beleza? Sejam bem-vindos a mais um vídeo. E no vídeo de hoje é os highlights, são os melhores momentos das partidas profissionais de CS. Caso você curte esse quadro aqui no canal, não se esquece, se inscreve aqui no canal, sua inscrição é muito importante para a evolução do mesmo aqui na plataforma. Seu like mostra para o YouTube que você curte demais esse estilo de conteúdo, fechou? Deixa de enrolação e vamos para o que importa, são os melhores momentos. Bora lá! It is likely going to be nullified here. We'll see if TGT can save it. No, not quite looking the right way. I'm going to get fallen, taking way too much space before they even realize what's going on. Out of yard lurk next at bat here. I think getting loud about things is Yuri. And looking for a fight, looking for an exit kill here, and he will find it. He's just not even allowing this retake to start when he is disrupting the entire defense trying to save this round. He picks up the dualies. And I mean, uh, again, you could see 9Z call a save here at this point in time. Yeah, I mean, there's not really anything to save. There's armor on Max. That's it. That's it. So Max will try and back away. Buddha I, knows he can't win this round. But one empty frag might make him feel a little bit better about it. Try and take their sets of armor away. And find himself face to face with Yuri's dualies. Don't think any respect's gonna be shown here early on based on that one. And the bomb will be going off. And Fury will start off the way we expected. With... Oh Kills just taking okay. eight. That was the only player out here. Buddha gonna be able to get something from heaven. See if he can hang on. Okay, Buddha swinging in. That's the bomb dropped as well. Here's a chance. Try to go for the upper hit. And Buddha has proved a thorn in their sides. Not done just yet though. Okay, Serato on the smoke fade. Oh, instant execution spots Buddha as well. Does he expect Martinez to have slipped through the smoke? That's the big question. He does, but Martinez will win that duel, win that fight. He leaves it to Yuri and Fallen. If you find a couple kills on your way out, that'd be fantastic. We'll also peek those spot in one. And Martinez collecting on the other. Yuri. Uh, last uh, man standing in, also revealed. Known. I do like that decision for Martinez. Oh boy. It's not done yet. It's not done yet. This is Yuri, one of the most lethal players in the game, but no. They're about to try and explode on this. Yuri's still working his way outside. Duel with Max, that's gonna be important. Max collects on that, so that's the first step. But they delete Buddha. Two players here in the defense. It's a decent setup. Once that mini smoke fades, they're in real trouble. And the spam's enough to stall them out. Oh Max my is just God. getting all these kills. Fury up. Oh! They have been... No one else is crossing. There's a player oh. caught. Max nearly cost him his life, but he's looking for another swing. He's got much more around that corner than he bargained for. And Yuri collects. DGT out. And no man's land. No one wants to swing him, though. Cello baits out the spray first and then gives him a wide swing to seal the deal. But still, Buddha holding steady on the site. Did I? Just no way you clear this. He's not going to clear Buddha. No, okay, so out of dead for it. Yuri might get the trade. Trying to go for the reload. Ooh, got the tag. The frag, and now Fallen are running straight into the AWP, so... I mean, it's mostly been rebuffed at this point. Still decent positions out the hut, but that's a messy fight. Somehow, the hut player gets almost nothing there, and it's all on Decay Serato, so... That one feels like a mechanical failure, and it's gonna be 9Z. Quem aí não curte jogar aquele CS com os amigos, né? Mas chega de jogar sem skins, vem pro CSGO Fest, o site que mais te ajuda a ter sua primeira skin. Entrando pelo link na descrição, você está 100% seguro. Além de resgatar os 10% de bônus com o cupom Aleart, ganha uma caixa de graça e pegue sua primeira skin para o seu inventário. Abraça essa oportunidade agora mesmo e não vacila. Oh, there's the run across. There's the check, now pressure on. A second player has dropped down. GT come to join him. DGT, rather. And DGT gonna be Johnny on the spot for this one. But it'll be one. Uh oh, they've lost Wasso as well. And oh, Buddha no. gone now. It's starting to get chaotic. Max needs to be the hero. The smoke Fallen has no idea. That drops the bomb. 45 seconds. This is still recoverable. Very much so now, as it all falls to Martinez, who's not in a position to be able to do much about it. But Such a lovely position from DGT, but he has to show up huge. He's got so much help as well. Huasso Peak standing alongside him, but they eventually do break the setup here. Molly prevents, and there you go. Huasso Peak lines them on up. 
And now they don't even know about DGT just yet. He has a freebie lined up on a silver platter for all to take care of business. And not enough that Art can do here. Caserato shut down. Pretty exciting. We're going to get right back to a ramp rush here. Fallen needs to defend. He's doing a lot of damage. Oh, they had a crazy counter flash right there. And now they got the whole team joining up in resistance. That ramp is off limits. And they've got to quickly readjust here. And they got to readjust up against an aggressing Art. He continues to press the issue here. Also, peak shadow advantage spotted. But Art still wins the duel. They'll be happy with five. And a pistol as well. Definitely a pistol at this point. No chance, no way. Fallen posted up here. In ramp. Actually, no, it's Caserato and Shello, the numbers. I faked me out once more. As they are so wont to do in Caserato. Oh. Well, uh, not needed. He's on the other side now. All right. Good. Uh, oh, you're never going to see it coming. But Yuri's here as well. Oh. And uh, to make sure they're not going to get overwhelmed. Nice comms. The reposition, the readjustment, the assassination. And another, and another, and Max coming out of the event. Okay. Oh my goodness. Let's get a little bit extra cheddar on this. Or if they just want to rock down secret. Falling could be pretty exposed to this mini play. Oh, he's in it. My goodness. Big trouble. Trusting Caserato in a big way. And he's eventually going to get claimed from the squeaky peak. Cello's in trouble. Cello's in a lot of trouble. All of us timing around this tower. Looking the wrong way at the wrong time. And this one's got to be over. Arced on a save, presumably. They're going to dive down. They're going to give it their all here, it seems. Maybe not. They'll let the bomb do the work. Both Fallen and Art towards the ramp early, and it is a hit. Oh, Fallen's in trouble. Can he live? No. Not quite. Stay alive for a moment, but... Oh, you got one off. But how about second off? Art misses his shot. He's got reinforcements now, though, in the form of Quetzalcoatl. And they have held strong against this ramp rush. 9Z tried to pick up the pace. But some of these pieces work. Max lurking about towards that outer yard, ready to split in towards this A-side. And they might be able to spring into action very quickly here. Max is being covered by this off. And he is immediately taken care of here. Meanwhile, Caserato just holds Mouse 1, trying to defend. But they have kind of discouraged any further aggression in towards this A-side. Cello. Big fight. Wins it. GT took down his reinforcements, but Yuri's here to make life difficult for them as they try to say take, and Cello slipped in towards Hut. That's a big play. Gives him a little bit of a smoke, kind of works in their favor, but keeps Cello alive! Oh, but... A little tough to interpret, but he's still laser-focused on what he's doing. Oh, Art knows! Art knows! He knows! Oh. He reads that Martinez hasn't slipped off the site either, and he's got the shot! He's got the clutch! The rifle's enough! On in such a great position already. So give him a fight and fallen. Able to deal with the pressure right there. Quick on the trigger. Oh, oh just another dry peek. Another one. Another dry peek into the up. Can't be giving them to him. Can't be giving him the dry peaks. Fallen. Made a career out of that. At this point, a several decades long career. At least a decade. Well over a decade. Probably not several decades. Although, unless. Martinez is good. There we go. On board with Yuri. He gets a kill and a half. It's maybe not as cool as it could have been. But he does get some impact. The cello now follows it up. So a man advantage established. They're trying to get outside, but Fallen is exacting his toll. Max is joining him. They'll play together. A Molotov back silo could actually make this kind of interesting. Well, that's not where it had to be. And it's not going to be the round they had to have. Nicely done for Furia. Third. Uh, sure. no, the bomb a little planted. So they have a smoke. Smoking a kit, so a defuse is possible, but a 5 on 5 retake still not an ideal aspect. Okay, 5 on 3, a lot more appealing. Ah, 
Max is doing some serious work here. Yuri trying to body shot his way through, and that's not gonna work out. All right. Strong positioning for it, no quick rotate either. So it's just these two players on site who are isolated. DGT and Max, though, getting the kills they need. Shutting down this mid presence. Is... Actually, someone tried to get cheeky up con, and this is a little disjointed from Furia. Not as fluid as we were maybe expecting. Because they cut off that cap presence, they seem a little timid to get out of apps, and understandably now, I mean, they're massively outnumbered. Quesarado gonna work on that! Quesarado! Gonna get to serious work on thinning the herd. He will be lost. It's all left to fall in to do the work now. Shots. Not Bomb's still in apps. This looks like it wants to be a link up on towards the A site. Wasso trades one for one. There's a player up con. I mean, this is a lot of forward positioning. If Arjun punishes this window player, which he can, now they're in trouble. Next one spotted as well. Still need to deal with Martinez, and Martinez is going to show why that's a tough task. There's no smoke for him. Just going to straight up duel with an AWP. Out towards Tiki with his teammates rotating in. That seems to be the case. Don't know how they're going to get this bomb down with no smoke. Well, they're going to find the right moment, the right time, but uh, it's going to cost them. A chance at the post plant. Buddha trades that out nicely. Two survivors. Bomb defused. Because they're reading the same thing that we are. But look at Yuri. He's in towards jungle looking the wrong way. Oh, no. Caught by the underbound player. And his teammates aren't with him to trade. Caserato's going to get it eventually. Sets up the nades. There might still be a chance at this round. This is chaos. Art, how has he found Martinez? What on earth? How do you read this team, man? How do you read this team? It's hard to read it, and I know where everyone is on the minimap. An incredibly tough off angle. Timing working well for Buddha to catch a freebie. But that puts everyone on notice now. Smoke on top of the bomb here. He needs to make a move, and he needs to make it quick here. Flash to ensure some safety into the site. Fallen avoids it and doesn't let him... Cover. And they're going to realize it quickly if they don't meet any resistance here. So Fallen is going to throw the utility, but yeah, it doesn't last long for Art. And now, you know, you ready your anchors. You ready Buddha here. Tell him to prepare himself as the chase is coming through. The Molotov keeps him in apartments, but Yuri has an entry to crack things open. Meanwhile, Buddha on the site, he gets nothing. He gets devastated here. We're also Peak running in the flames right in the case. Serato's open arms here. You'll be able to close out on him. And now jumping into the site, it's Max to save the day. He still gets shut down. Case Serato looking to do it all. And he finds the last as well. Not just throwing the smokes, not telegraphing this. Oh, and that's exactly why. Now they throw the smokes. Now they get the util set up. And boom. Vision blocked Martinez through. Beautiful. Martinez dead as Fallen anticipates it. Got to get up pretty early in the morning to catch on Fallen slipping. Uh, has his teammates back in a big way. Look at this. He's even watching the flank. The bomb isn't so secure now. That actually does get fallen off the flank right now. That'll allow for this to come through uh -huh. from Max. The bomb just been dropped. The chaos in the server is kind of catching them off guard. No longer a man advantage. It has slipped quickly. And now it's up to Yuri and Caserato to save the day again. Well, you want no one else. No other duo to try and make this happen. Trying to draw as much focus as possible to set up case Serrano. That's exactly what happens, and that's why. Now they scale up. The timing's good here, but Art finally spots it out, and he gets that smoke down. He tries to play forward in it, but it immediately goes down. Now, they yeah. check. Okay, they, they check. check. They you Fool me once. Shame on you. Fool me twice. Can't get fooled again. And that, folks, is why it's important to mix up your pistols, especially when you're playing the same team in two days on the same map. Just a different pistol, man. Anything else? Well, 9Z will now have won both pistols here on Mirage. It is the ideal setup to potentially snatch their opponent's map pick and make a series of this. Absolutely right. They got six rounds off of investments, uh, pistols rather, because mm. the four spice came through. But as you put the emphasis on this gun round here, it is fallen that picks up the first kill. I think he was boosted into apartments, so he just plucks out Buddha on the lurk. A man advantage established here. And continued as Yuri will find one. Finally, Martinez strikes back, catches a jiggle. 
Molly does not clear cello in firebox. He's been here the whole time. They get the kill on Art. But cello is just waiting for somebody to try and plant that bomb. 20 seconds. Time's getting short. Cello still in here. And now he's struck. And now they know they can't plant. They can't plant this dang bomb until they deal with cello. The nade fortunately will do it for them. Martinez is pulled off on that spam though. He's so low now. Seven, six, stick it. five. Another run of spam might just do it. Oh, he's got the bomb down. Gives Wasso a chance to close this. But he can do no such thing. Ooh, fallen. Collects on the first Buddha, able to trade out before its window, but there's a lot of presence here, and yeah, kicking the hornet's nest. Well, you're gonna get stung. Martinez in the round from falling back to back now on the gun rounds when it matters the most. He the question is, when can fall and get his eyes around? He's really wary that someone's coming through Khan, but he's got support for it. Whoa, now there's the pressure on Fallen hits a quick flick. He's lost his teammate though. Fallen will have to do more work, and this is exactly what he was worried about. The play through Khan comes in late, but it works out. And at this point, Yuri left alone is probably gonna have to save. He wants a fight though. Yeah, it's a little overzealous, perhaps. Here's the round to step up. Here's the round to make his presence known. Back at the bench, they're dropping down out of the van. Tags, but no kills, and that should trigger a save. If even they can, K Serato won't be able to. Bomb down and planted 11 on the board for 9Z, and Furia might have to swallow their pride and play for overtime. You're going to have to give this guy even more credit for what he has done so far. And now the op not guaranteed to be saved here. Buddha. But he's got to be maybe more cautious. I mean, this is an impossible position to work from. He's a bit Molotov to try and force out the fight. And Fallen has won it. Fallen has won it. He's won it. And he's away. So it works out. It pays off. They bet on Fallen and Fallen rewards them. Okay, Serato has now taken the next. Not... An ideal prospect. Maltal's being deployed. Oh boy. E, Art's positioning poor. Had no idea Wasa was in the angle. And now they might be in trouble. But Keserato? Who else? Looking to bail them out. Only gets one. Back into a two on two. This could be the map. This could be Yuri. It. It's all on Shello. Here's his hero moment. Misses the shot. Hasn't been great with that secondary up, but he'll try. And they're past him into the post plant scenario. Shello doesn't even have armor behind this. Chose the AWP over it. He got not the shot. Backing him off of it. Martinez on the line. And we're going to a third. We're going. Fala galera, desculpa atrapalhar o vídeo de vocês, mas eu tenho um recado muito importante. Agora o canal Aleartes junto com a Face City são parceiros. E eles nos deram a oportunidade de criar um clã do canal aqui para vocês. E o mais importante aqui do clã, que além de você jogar aqui dentro do clã, você pode vir aqui em tabela de classificação, você vai ver aqui as premiações. Tem premiação de top 1 até o top 20, você pode ganhar pontos ou também ganhar skin para quem ficar em primeiro e segundo lugar. Fechou? Essa é a primeira season aqui, lembrando que esses pontos aqui você pode trocar por itens da Face City e também por skins. Então, você só tem a ganhar. Fechou? Te convido aqui, link tá na descrição, participa do nosso clã e dá essa força lá pro canal. Tamo junto e continua com o vídeo. Nice. Seeing if he's able to show up to the challenge. All a fake though. They've cut off these rotates right now. There's cello. That's it on this B side. He does find a good kill to put into a 4v5, but it's as, as, as a sacrifice to the site. He still cuts things off though and delivers another one. So a 5v3 now. That's kicking the pants for cello when he desperately needs. Bomb, they can't deny. But it's all about this retake now, Buddha. The first line of defense. Max behind him. But they can't get the kills. It's a massacre on the retake. Martinez will finally find one, but smoked off. It just should be little ability for him to do anything to impact this defuse more so now. So they're actually completely past Temple. Vaughn's ability to do something to talk here might be limited. Keserato down for nothing. Fallen kind of stuck here, doesn't want to get overwhelmed, so he's repositioned, giving up audio cues in the process. Buddha knows what he's got. If he can get this kill, it'd be massive. But as it is, a 4 and 4 with the bomb down on A. Control of Donut. Martinez is the next big piece. He's got Max to help him on this particular fight. The 1 2 punch, the wombo combo, and Art not close enough at hand to do anything about this on the trade that's falling apart for Furia. Force by for 9Z is good. Art has to save Furia.
Come out the gate swinging, but the counter punch is swift in 9Z. Caught in the corner. Maxwell have heard all of this. Surely he'll be ready. But it's a one-two punch. Even if he clears out the corner player, Yuri's ready to swing just off the contact. There it is. The trade is on. Yuri continuing to exact his price. Close up. Udok swinging in, but the trade is there. These setups are great for Furia. Leaves everything on to Martinez. Yuri has just wrecked them. Ruined them. With three kills off of the saved Galil. Right. Let's see if that smoke keeps him at bay here. No, they threw it. They've got to do. This is the one thrust in the round. Fallen. One and a half. Is it enough? Might be. Bomb being planted. Spray not on here for Art. Gotta be wary not to give up the kill. So a four and four retaken. DGT on the other side of the map is gonna hold Yuri on this rotation. Now DGT, he found his kill on Cello. This is so back and forth to kick off this third map, and it's great to see if Nainzi can keep punching back. Keep showing up. There. Nainzi gonna be able to read into that in time here. We'll fast out middle this time around, and the Mollies and 8Gs will tick them down. Great start to this defense. Caserato blinded up. The Molotov should allow them the possibility. There's the catch. Oh, okay. I was going to say no one's watching, but Cello managed to snap around and tie the Molotov. Distracted just a bit too much, and Martinez has missed his window to plant. Down he goes. No casualties for Furia. It's a great chance for the retake. Ball pulls off the mid. Yuri has to get active. He's caught, but oh no, they're losing the A site defenders. Art under pressure. Knows he's getting pinched. No chance there. And what a shot. What was Fallen looking at? Spooked by his own teammates' footsteps, I think. Cello now just trying to retrieve the gun and get out of there, but he'll be able to do no such thing. It's a team. Putting pressure on these B players here. There's still three of them. Still plenty to go around here. Art goes for a wide swing. Cello converts the kill off the back of it. That's critical. Command advantage. That's critical. Even if it's one for one there, ah, it's such a nightmare situation for Furia. But with this 30 seconds getting late, ooh, ooh, ooh. The aggression there, <laughs> that's, uh, that's tenuous. Art is low, so he wants to get something done, but... Well, this B play is coming. Three players are here for Furia. Make that two. Cello has to stand tall once again, and he's not able to do so. Puts all the pressure on Quesarado. Wants to try and deny this ball, and he won't be able to do so. So Fallen, alone with an MP9 that we see represents South America. This next Intel Extreme Masters. Well, I like it. Last nail gun in action. Not exactly <laughs> orthodox, but when Yuri just brains somebody through the smoke, why not? Makes life a little easier. Fallen, mostly looking to be a utility mule here. Artikin, Artikin, Fallen! Oh, a two-piece! Oh, oh, oh. Who needs armor? Just don't let them shoot back! Unarmored, glass cannon, MP9, and Fallen still gets two kills. What's your excuse? <laughs> There's no way it works out. Martinez is gonna give him something he might get to think about on the way out, but yeah, he's chased. It's after One, time. Two. No, oh, just, just about. Before. And it's not the angle you would typically check. Don't think this flashbang catches him. Max is thinking, how much of this rune do I get? And, well, there's the answer. Not enough. Not enough to be the difference maker. Fallen takes out the ramp player. It's all about this cave thrust, which Yuri is positioned to shut down. Oh, my God. Quasso slipped past him, though. But there's no time. There's no time. 15, 15. seconds. They have no idea. Here we go. He needs both. He knows he needs both. Fallen tracking into him. You oh. got to get the kill now. You got to go now. And there's just not enough time. Oh, they're going to chase him after time as well. He throws the hop out. He's yeah. defenseless. Let's see. Yeah, I think it could be. Yeah, the Molotovs, at least one of them is out of hands right now. Here comes the hit. We'll see if they leave the bomb behind. Of course, it doesn't work if you don't take the site in the first place. And actually, at least one of the Molotovs has actually been there spent. It so it hasn't been dropped behind. Ooh. Bomb was trying to be planted, but it's denied. <laughs> None of this works if you can't plant the bomb. DGT says, oh, you're trying to plant open on me? On me? 
Hello? Oh. We know. We are familiar with your game. And their game is not gonna work at all. This wasp was coming into clear. Does he check Cubby? All the timing here. Cello's caught, so they've cleaned this out. Now they're realizing. Well, that was just the lurk. Time to get active. Time to get moving. Pressure on for Buddha in the meantime. Would love a smoker or a Molotov right now to just stall them out a little bit. It is Wasso wants to come back around, but okay, the best way to stall them out is to shoot them. They can't move. If they're dead. That's what Buddha says. And Wasso agrees. More points of evidence. Bomb drop down, flank developing through A main. Kisarado. There's a timer on this, and it's not just the 30 seconds on the top of the board. It's all about Max's flank here. Oh, never expected the hit to come from this side, but Max will find his second. I'm just gonna give him a repeat here off that flashbang knowledge. Look at this donut presence though. Question is, can the bomb rotate? Well, with Fallen claiming that kill, oh, it might just going towards B regardless. Now they got both sites. They don't know what to do with it. Bomb's rotating, but it's gonna go A main. Oh no. Wait, okay, Buddha strikes early. How could he know? The bomb was coming from spawn, but there was a moment here where things could have gotten massively out of hand. Oh. They still might. Bomb doesn't know which way to go now. How much time is left? 45 seconds. Cello can reroute. If they pinch the A main player, they know where they two are. They've got three players on the A side of the map. But no cello sticking around towards B, which will give Max a chance to move. But Max, oh. knowing there was presence on A, thinking he just found a lurk. How do you read this? How do you read that the bomb is here? Cello will... Lines is confusing because nobody in their right mind would make any sort of crazy moves at a scoreline line. Martinez. Sorry, it's uh, Wasso. Once again, the numbers have faked me out. Wasso in the angle. Max has just killed two in elbow. So a shutdown early on as 9Z looks to completely isolate. Fury is one round win. Cello on the edge of the smoke. Magic fades. Wasso. Oh, in trouble. Got some damage on Fallen. Now the A site is under siege. The problem is they don't have any more smokes. So they're gonna have to do this with the guns. DGT swings out, DGT. Oh no, had to commit once he went through, but tried to do the best of both worlds and he split the difference. And it all falls to Martinez now. This site control has fallen apart. Stars were supposed to shine here for Furia. Terrorists win. It's not the way it's supposed to be. And... Yellow drop down. Cello, checked. First one found, spam's good. DGT should not be long for this world. In fact, he burns up. Up, down. And Yuri with the follow-up. Now this brawl for A, having great results. That's a nice shot for Wasso. Keeps the numbers even. And they don't have these footholds forward. Yuri are thinking about bailing, but that trade. They've lost all their control on A. It's down to a 2v2 and they're reassessing. That lack of a kid is just killer. That is just a back. Breaker and Furia. Speaking of backbreakers, are going to snap the spine. There goes Spam on the site. 20 seconds. 20 seconds, Cole. Now they have to get through the gauntlet. The full stack is coming through from 9Z, but they've taken cave. That's the first step. Buddha answers it. The op on the angle, though. Bomb's gonna be planted open. This is so ambitious that they're still playing. No oh, and it's denied, but the bomb is down. It all falls to K Serato. At least the numbers punched in half a second to spare, maybe. They you know where Keserato is. They got the idea. They got oh. the read, but they're just into his crosshair. Keserato. The star has come alive. It's just going to be a stick. Keserato's not calling the buff. DGT's just stuck it. Oh, right under his nose. So in towards A, they will go once more. Into the breach. 35 seconds. This is the commit now. But you got Wasso. Molly. Still here. Oh, they're going to think this is clear. They're going to think this is clear. The tick. The tick. They don't hear it. There's too much noise on the site. And it's a shutdown. 9Z are one kill away from going to IEM Dallas. Can they punch their tickets now with one headshot in case Serato? The hero of the last. So much more to do here. And Wasso Peak will make sure that 9Z will be at the Intel Extreme Masters Dallas E aí, gostou dos melhores momentos de hoje? Não se esquece, as estatísticas estão aqui para você analisar. Pausa o vídeo caso você queira ver e acompanhar tudo certinho. Sua inscrição e seu like aqui embaixo é muito importante para a evolução do canal. Te vejo no próximo vídeo. Fui.